Welcome back, YouTube, to another video. Today is a quick update. We have energy update, which is heart chakra has been in pain for multiple days. Um, upon waking and sometimes late at night, possibly because my stupid demon ex friend is trying to get under my skin, even though he blocked me. Uh, actually, he didn't block me, he just deactivated his account, and I have not been on Facebook for over three weeks now. And, or is it the Spirit Guardian saying you need to fix your mistake and I have not gone back and told him, hey, like, you made a mistake, it's my fault that, uh, and all that. Um, it is right before my bedtime, so I am a bit off and slow, uh, brain slowing down, the, the frequency, brain waves. Okay, that's the energy update, uh, been in a funk, even though during the day I distract my mind from the, the pain, what I'm feeling in the heart chakra, um, then when you go to bed and you're laying there trying to sleep, that's when all these, the crazy gets more real, like all these different thoughts. And uh, last night was pretty bad, to be honest. Uh, I, I do have my moments where I, I do get like that and I don't know how I pull through to be honest I I don't know how but I do the important thing is to remember when things get rough push forward even if you do not know notice you are unwell of it but you push forward, even when you lose all hope, you push forward, even if you are unwell of it. For me, personally, I have no flippin' idea how I push forward, how I pull through, but I do. The pain will subside eventually, I don't know when, but it always does. I've been here many times with this person, so I, I know these patterns. But if it is from this new person, the voices have not stopped, they keep telling me, go back fix your mistake. I have not made uh, a new account on Facebook to go back to this person and say, hey, I made a mistake. Can we fix this? There was still trauma there, uh, psychologically. Not spiritually, I'm talking about the, the psych, uh, psyche, um, it is a uh, trauma though that I am currently trying to work through still, and that probably doesn't help the heart chakra under attack by either my ex demon friend or the new trauma. I don't know, but all I do what I do know is I am still here. Breathing. 
I might be losing my sanity because the world around me is in chaos, but the important thing is I am still a light worker. I am changing my own darkness into light. You cannot change evil into light. You cannot change a murderer into a good person. You can't. With that being said, what a light worker does, what a real one does, who is an angel of the light, we help the the people who come to us can come for us to a brain. You're not working. As a light worker, we help heal. We are heal nurse. We give advice to people. However, all I can do is plant the seed of success onto you who may then decides for themselves what to do, how to heal yourself. I can't heal you. You have to heal your own self. The important thing is think for yourself. Have a free mind. What, what do I mean? Many people follow other people's beliefs. They don't think for themselves. As a healer, we remind you how to heal yourself because ultimately you have to do the work. You have to think for yourself. And many people do not. Sheep follow sheep. Open minded people step out of their comfort zone and explore the world around them. Anyone who steps into the light and knows their light is an angel. They are not a demon. But if they fall into the same mistakes as mortals, then they are demons who were misguided. Humans can be demons. Humans might not be able to grasp what it means to be divine. Many people get that wrong. Many people think you must forgive everyone for every little thing. Karma does not exist for light workers. Karma is the demons are karma. There are just evil people in the world. Bad things happen to what? Evil people. However, two sides of the coin. That's part one. Part two. Bad things can happen to light workers as well. What in the world do I mean? Trauma. Abuse. Anyone who learns the lessons of evil ver negativity versus positivity versus, well, good and evil, I mean, that's the common trait, right? As a light worker, I have learned what I hate, what I do not want in my life, what I do not want for my own child, if I have one. 
I will not make the same mistakes that happened onto me. The abuse, the drama, the trauma, etc. Example. You can say no to being a bully. You can say no to hidden people. If you say no to these evil acts, then chances are you are good. You are an angel. Angels are not just of light. We carry baggage. We carry pain in our hearts, in our mind, in our soul. But we came out on top. We rose from hell. We rose and came back stronger than ever because we took the high road, because it was hard, not because it was easy. Many people. Do not take the high road. Many people do not learn how to carry on, how to. Uh, my cat is crying, and I don't know why. Of course, my mic is picking this up. <laughs> You coming in? No? Okay. Not many people know how to soldier on. They don't know how to heal themselves and they constantly make the same mistake over and over again. It can be a simple question as why do I keep meeting the wrong Types of men. The question. The question is, why are you allowing that into your life? Why do you continue the cycle? You have to question everything. Your reality. Question everything. Not too many will do this. For me, I guess I am a natural skeptic. I question everything. Your worth to me. Are you loyal? Will you hurt me? Are you negative to me? Is this environment negative to me? Are the people around me negative on my energy? The the questions can go on. But you have to start analyzing everything. Then the world around you makes more sense. A lot of sense, to be honest. Demons do not care for deep knowledge. All they want is what? Greed, greed, lust, and more greed. They don't care about spirituality. All they want is to fill the pockets with money and material items that do not serve them. Is it a want or is it a need? Chances are, you want things more than you need them. Do I want to be rich or do I need? To be rich in the moment. Rich in the rich in the moment is what? For me, it means emotional, happy, bliss, and love. That type of rich. I do not speak of money. Do I want? A trophy husband. 
Or do I want a person who will be into me? Into the laurels of my soul? Who will understand and accept me for what I am deep down? You have to analyze everything. Question everything. Everything will make more sense when you do that. What do I need in this moment right here and now? Balance. As a light worker, I am here to balance, not change evil into good. You can not do that. All you can do is observe. Is this person demonic thinking or is this person needing guidance? And if so, will they accept my views? As in the type of content I show. Morals, to be more exact. Do they see a similar world as I do? The world is corrupt. The world is in chaos. The world is full of blood. Blood said war is disgusting. It's downright wrong. Humans, no. Demons fight demons. Demons fight anyone who lets them. If you fight, you have to ask yourself, why am I fighting? Is it because I was programmed? Or is it because I will not allow this troll to get under my skin? As I said, analyze everything. Think for yourself. Become free. Remove yourself from the matrix. Do not repeat the same mistakes mortals do. Have you stumbled back into those patterns? Senses are, you're not. An angel, because you have already fallen too many times, repeating the same mistake and cannot climb up. I know I met a person who wanted pity, but he refused to see that he cannot help this person. He needed to remove these toxic people from his life. Instead, he wanted to change them. You cannot change a person's mind. Leave them alone. They have to change for them, not because you want to change them. Only a demon would do this. A mortal. An angel will not allow themselves to change another person. A plant is a plant. You cannot change it. Do not believe you can change anyone. You can only change yourself, not someone else. I am only planting the seeds of suggestion. What you Except is on you, not because of me. I did not change your mind. You did that.
kind of unexpected trends, colon. I hear my voice. I only see a waterfall, like from a canyon wall, because it's like dirt colored. Uh, not rock, like a uh, stone, like gray. It's more like um, brown. So, canyon, okay. The words are... The waters are running murky. You can't see clearly. Trust your higher instinct instincts. Trust in your soul to find the answers you seek. Only then will you know what you are. You were either human, mortal, a demon, or an angel. There's only three species on Earth. Human, Palladian demon, or angel, dragon, was a fairy, light being. The Anunnaki go by many different names. These are just a few of them. Look within your soul to know which race you are. You cannot change your race. All you can do is simply forget. And now you have to find the answer again. It is time to know. Arise, awake, the time is near. Time is slowly running out. I see the eye of Ra or the eye of Horus. I forget which name it is. Uh, it's gold. I see the the gold, golden version. The eye itself is a blue light, like glowing. Which is telling me heightened spiritual intellect, the third eye, which um, I'm seeing now a flash of white light, sun rays, white light. Ow. I hear footsteps. The words of a mouth. Go back to what you are. Go back. It is time 
to remember. Awake your soul. Awake it now. It is time to remember. Cast no shadow. Cast no darkness. For your light casts the shadow. Vanquish these shadows that you see. Cut them out of your life. Return to a pure light version of you. Remove the shadows from your aura. Return to light. Return to purity. Return, return, return. It is time. It is now. Oh, that is dragon magic for you. Dragons can be fierce, but we are bound by no one, bound by no cage. But to actually convey that is on another level, so to speak. Many people will be afraid of the true aura of the true soul. Whoever attacks you is a demon. Do not be scared of what you are. You cannot change your face. Your soul is what it is. And for me, I know I am a dragon, an angel of the light. I am no mortal. I cannot be a mortal. When I had that thought last night, I grimaced at it. No win. Mortals disgust me. What they have done to this planet disgusts me. Nothing but greed and destruction, bloodshed. Mankind goes against the laws of nature. For they have no laws, except to protect their own kind, their own skin, not just their own kind. Some refuse that. Some only look out for number one, and that in itself is negative. Cal for you, but also but also your other and this is why I don't record the You can't help everyone. You can only plant the seeds of success in. Be mindful of your energy. Make sure you do not run out. That you do not exhaust yourself when helping other people. If you help too many, there is your answer. 
your energy goes away, make sure you have a proper balance. Do not exhaust yourself. I thank you for your time, and until we meet again, Namaste, my friends. Thank you for watching and reaching the end. If you are not subscribed, please do so to not miss out on new content. And hit that like button to show your support for the channel. Leave a comment down below. I love interacting with my friends. 